Given that he's out in the desert, still no escaping this gloom of Westminster, the breaking news coming through from Downing Street uh, that the Prime Minister says he has full uh, confidence in Cabinet Office Minister Sir Gavin Williamson. Uh, now, this was obviously uh, a suggestion that maybe he may have to move him on uh, after the uh, the texts that were uh, to the former uh, Chief Whip Wendy Morton and other allegations about his behaviour. Yeah, all rather odd this. It had emerged at the weekend. Gavin Williamson, who had previously been a Chief Whip back in the day, was also briefly Defence Secretary and Education Secretary. I think it's fair to say he didn't necessarily flourish in those last two postings. He's been brought back into the government by Rishi Sunak, but it emerged, as I say in the Sunday Times yesterday, that he had sent abusive texts to the then Chief Whip. Uh, Wendy Morton, and uh, that that was viewed as unacceptable by those within uh, government. We heard uh, from government ministers yesterday saying it wasn't acceptable. We heard from Rishi Sunak in the plane on the way over to COP27 that he thought the text messages were unacceptable. There is an allegation of bullying. Now, it has been investigated by Conservative Party Central Office at the time when these texts were sent in the run-up to the Queen's funeral. Gavin Williamson was merely a backbench MP, though we know that Rishi Sunak was aware of the complaint of bullying mm. made against uh, the Cabinet Office Minister uh, when he appointed him to that post. Uh, Rishi Sunak seems to be suggesting that, yes, what he did was not right, it was wrong, uh, but it is not now the time to act because of that investigation. And as you say, in the last couple of minutes, the Downing Street spokesperson here in London has said that the Prime Minister does have full confidence in him. I think for some of the critics, we're likely probably to see more stories emerge about Gavin Williamson in the days to come. There are more allegations in some of the papers uh, today. He's not necessarily the most liked figure, I would suggest, here at Westminster. But people would suggest, why does there need to be an, an investigation when there's an acceptance by Gavin Williamson, by those in government, by the Prime Minister himself, that the messages were not acceptable? Yeah. Uh, the political pressure will glow, grow, I think, at Labour piling on, saying uh, that the Prime Minister needs to act now on this. But for the time being, uh, the Prime Minister, Rishi Sunak, seems to be uh, digging in, even if it is, as you say, overshadowing slightly that visit yeah. to Egypt.